Good morning, everyone, and welcome to TransWest Truck Trailer RV. We are located in Frederick, Colorado. My name is Larry Vickers. Very excited about the truck we're going to look at today. I guarantee you'll never, you will not see another one of these on the market. This is a 2022 Ram 5500. The truck has 33,000 miles. The conversion was done by Utility Body Works. The truck was purchased new and then sent to them and they did the conversion on it for us. So as we look at it from the side, let's talk about a few things that really jump out at us. Well, first, as, as you look at the bed of the truck, we see it comes with a substantial amount of storage. There's a smaller storage component back here. And as you can see, it is lined, so that will protect the truck for years to come. It comes with two fuel tanks. This one is 22 gallon. This one is 52 gallon. So combined 74 gallons of fuel this holds. The depth tank, which is located right here holds 5.74 gallons of fuel. Data is showing that you use about 3% of depth per one gallon of fuel. So if you use 100 gallons of fuel, you're gonna go through three gallons of depth. As we take a look inside this storage component, you'll see an air gauge and an adjustment. This is for the Hensley hitch to raise or lower that, and we'll take a look at that hitch a little bit later on. In addition to being lined, it also has a spot up there in the corner, which runs all the way through the truck. So if you have pipe, things of like that, you can put those there for storage as well. This truck is the limited trim package. It says so here with the Ram logo there. As we come around and take a look directly in front, obviously the big thing we're going to notice is the grill guard. That is a ranch hand, so that's top of the line. It's really going to protect the truck, especially if you live close, like for instance where we are, right next to the Rocky Mountains, traveling through there, you never know what wildlife's gonna jump out in front of you. So that's a really smart investment to add to the truck, simply to help protect it. We see sensors running across the bottom. So if you get ready to travel and there's someone or something here or below, it's gonna notify you of that. We see tow hooks located in the center of the truck. Now let's take a look under the hood. That's the Cummins 6.7 liter engine. It is coupled with the Iason six speed transmission. This offers roughly 360 horsepower. So really an engine that doesn't need much introduction it has proven itself over time to be very durable and one that's simply going to last. As we come around, we see the 5500 badge and heavy duty located there. It comes with a rather aggressive tire. Those are 255. 70 R19. As we take a look inside the driver's seat, both the driver and passenger seat are both heated and vented. One unique thing about this conversion is the suspension. As we see, it comes with the Kellerman air suspension. Now that is front and rear. So you're basically an air ride suspension. That also allows you to dump air out of the bed of the truck. 
if you've been watching the videos for a while, you see how the Freightliners have a dump valve in them that drops the air out. This does the same thing. So why is that important? When would we use that? Well, basically when you hook up your trailer is when you would use it, dump all the air out, utilize the backup camera that the truck comes with, makes hooking up a trailer very simple. As we take a look at the back seat, this is also heated. In addition, we see charge ports located directly in the middle. And from this view, really gives us a good chance to see the trim level what the limited package offers. We see stitching along here. And as we look at the door panel, we see a couple of different colors with stitching and embroidery work done there. Now, as we focus on the bed of the truck, this is a storage box. Some people misinterpret that for a fuel tank, but this is a storage box located here. Furthermore, storage box located on top. Again, you'll notice the lining and you, there's a light switch located there. As we come around behind, we notice that the bed is lined. As we focus in on the hitch, that is the Hensley hitch, also known as the trailer saver. You'll see airbags underneath it, located here. That will allow you to have basically a smoother ride and it's easier on the trailer. Since the trailer is riding on air, it really helps with longevity of the trailer in addition to helping the truck out as well. As you can see, it comes with a gooseneck ball. If you do, or if you are in need of a fifth wheel hitch, we can simply swap that out for you. As we come on back and down, we see additional sensors running across the bumper to notify you if there's someone or something directly behind you. As we come around and take a look from this view, since this is a 2022, there is plenty of factory warranty left. It's up to 100,000 miles on the powertrain. In addition to that, five years. So, since this truck only has 33,000 miles, you still have plenty of factory warranty left. It is three years, 36,000 miles on the new warranty, which is basically the bumper to bumper. As we take a look inside the passenger seat, again, heated and vented. Adjustments to the seat can be made here. In addition to here, this is for the lumbar system, which basically lets air in and out of the back of the seat. As we take a look inside the glove box, you can see it comes with all the original manuals. And here shows us the trim level as well, limited with embroidery work done right there. As we take a look at the back seat, this comes can come up and it has a small platform located here to help keep things off of the floor. Example of when you would use that, I've had people buy them that haul like dogs or pets with them. You put that down and let them right here, which helps keep them up off the floor. It comes with floor mats that run from side to side that helps protect the interior of the truck and makes it simpler to clean. Now let's crawl on in and take a closer look. truck is stock number 5U231470. It is a push button start located right there. One thing I really like about this truck is the size of the screen. 
You see, it's really large, which enables you to see things very clearly. An example, right now we're in reverse. So that's the backup camera. So that it does offer a few options. There's one in addition to there on the side. Right there's one of the rear. That's the one you're gonna use when you go to hook up your gooseneck trailer. As we come up here, hazards located here. This is the adjustment for the fan. It's located on the side. So you can make both sides hotter or cooler depending on what the preference of the individual. Again, you can turn the fan speed up or down located here. As we come across here, you can also do that from the screen in terms of comfort. It comes with navigation located there. One service we will provide is uh, Bluetoothing your phone to it to have everything set up when you're ready to go. This one gives you information on the vehicle itself. One other thing you can do is hook up to Uconnect since this is a Dodge or Ram product and that is a basically a, a service where you can start the vehicle from your phone. It allows you to do a, really a lot of things from it. Right here is the trailer brake. This is the tow haul assist. This is the exhaust brake. An example of when you would use that if you're towing down a sharp decline, you turn that exhaust brake on and basically that's gonna slow everything down. Consequently, it will make things safer for you and your family and the other drivers on the road as well. We see here a couple of charging ports. As we take a look at the console, this pops on up for a smaller storage capacity there, and then that opens on up for even more storage as well. As we glance up real quick and take a look here, there is a window in the back that you can open or close. In addition, these buttons are for more lighting on the inside. As we take a look at the mirror, that's a little bit different, okay? That's a camera. And that takes a little bit of getting used to, but the advantage that has over a traditional mirror, see how everything looks clear and crisper? So once you get used to that, that's one thing you're really gonna take advantage of and enjoy that. So as we review, this is a 2022 Ram 5500 with 33,000 miles on it. And I know people have been waiting on this truck. We're finally able to put it out to the public, simply waiting on the title to get here. So now it's all good, we're ready to go. So for more information, give me a call. The work number is 303-684-3404. The cell number is 970-370-4067. Feel free to email me at larry.vickers at transwest.com. Or for more information, simply click on the link below. Thanks for tuning in today.